Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and uh, welcome to Leftover Object 120 gameplay. So, cast your mind back a few weeks. We had the 120 on the channel and uh, this is the footage I didn't use. So I get to use it, get to delete it, put it to bed and uh, yeah, get to have a chat to you guys at the same time about something completely freaking different. Uh, yeah, where have we been this week? Well, in England it's been rather hot. I've been working, well, not a silly amount of hours, but a normal amount of hours, and uh, yeah, I couldn't be asked, to be fair. It's been like 30 to 35 degrees this week, so it's like, yeah, no, thank you. But we're back on schedule now. Had a bit of a break, and uh, quite feel a bit better for it, actually. And uh, yeah, so, back on schedule, back with the videos, and this is the first one. And uh, second up, we're going to chat about, yes, Operation Summer. What do you think of this? Comments down below if you're doing it, if you're not doing it. I'm personally not doing it because I just don't have the time. Uh, yeah, you work full time and you're going to grind out the blueprints and then the parts. It's not going to happen, is it really? But I've got the blueprints for the T34E, which I've already got anyway. I thought I might get the T34E and then sell it or sell one of the vehicles and then bump some skins with it on the marketplace. but. Yeah, not being funny, but the IS-7 so far at my grasp, well, I haven't even bothered. I basically think if you're uh, working full-time or you've got a fam to look after, you're pretty much screwed. I mean, not to bet, it's, you know, like it's not... Yeah, the IS-7 is going to be a great tank to have. So if it's too easy to get, then everyone's going to have it and it's going to span the whole thing out. So, yeah. I understand why the meant to out your reach a little bit there. But if you work full-time, it's dead. It's not going to happen. Basically, it's aimed at students who are off for the summer, kids, people who are unemployed, who well, might be disabled, or whatever. Yeah, that's not a problem. I'm not fussed about that at all. But it would be nice if they put it up for sale, just for a day or two, to say, yep, it's coming up for sale. Cost 30, 40 quid. Get the IS-7. Boom, chuck your money into it. So everyone gets a chance to get hold of it. Because it's going to be one of them rare tanks that no one's going to have. Hopefully, they'll let me borrow it. Fingers crossed. And then uh, we're going to miss out. Oh, see what we're missing out on. I might be able to take it out. A couple of matches. And, uh, um, yeah. See what we could have had. But, yeah. So, it's my two pence, really. I could have made it a little bit different. But I understand, like I say, why they made it so hard to get older. Because it's going to be a great tank. It is going to be a good tank. And it will be a game changer. If you get six, seven of them on a match... They're going to rip everyone's heads off. And it's not going to be fun for anyone else. But, yeah. Also, are there going to be planes? Apparently there are going to be a, a, a plane one. But it'd be the same again. It'd be a good plane to have, like a jet coming in. I don't know what it is. They reckon it's coming up, but they haven't got it finalised yet. Um, yeah. And it's going to be the same again. Grind this out, grind that out. And you've got two or three hours a night to play. If you're lucky. It's not going to happen. I mean, this T-34 you had to get before the IS-7. So, I managed to get that out. 20 kills, not a problem. 10 kills in realistic, no problem. And then 4 wins above 10%. Yeah, you can do it, it's not a problem. But, getting uh, 4 2,000 point games in ground forces. And then I think it is 5 kill assists with your team, with your squad mates. It's not going to happen. Not in a couple of hours. Just to be fair. It's not going to, you're not going to do both, are you? So, yeah, you're pretty much out of the game. And uh, I figured I was going to be screwed for that. And then you've got the parts thing on top of it, like the Tiger. And that was crap in the first place. I mean, I, I, I kicked the arse out of that Tiger. I got it, but I had to buy the last bits into it. So it's cost me like... I think it cost me about five, five quid in the end. Got some of my parts I had, and then bought the parts to get the Tiger. So, yeah, but it's not the point. You shouldn't have to pay for the bloody thing. If they're going to pay for it like that, they might as well let you pay golden, buy it with golden eagles and then be done with it. So you get the choice to buy it or to grind it. I mean, I personally, I'd, I'd get the i7 if I had a choice. I would get it. Because it looks fun. I, mean, I played in World of Tanks many years ago. It's not a nice big tank. And it is an iconic tank. I mean, you get on that battlefield and you know about it. So, yeah. So, if they're... Uh, I pretty much feel like you're isolated out if you work. 
or you've got a family or you're short on time but yeah catch 22 you're not they're not trying to isolate you on purpose they're just trying to make it so it's a rare tank but it's still crap never mind so what's cut up with the channel the next well, few weeks we have some vampire gameplay do lots of that we have a uh, some uh, we have a squadron week coming up where i showcase different members of the squadron oh, can you see that look about to kill him as well yeah so i showcase different members of the squadron and then there uh, you get to meet them and if you want to join of course you're more than welcome to but we'll go for that at a later date we're gonna have all the squadron leaders the different trainers the different sergeants yeah it's gonna be fun also, got the Mao's coming up. T-34 as well. Not the Russian, the American version. Bugger off. Uh, yeah, so plenty going on the channel. Please let me know down below what you think about this summer thing. And also let me know what you might want to see on the channel in the future. Any ideas? Any tanks you want to see on there? Perhaps even planes? I've also taken up the Ju-78 B-2. Little Stuka. Sucks. But yeah, it's all happening. So, Object 120. Yes, we had this on the channel a while back, and it was pretty cool. I borrowed it for a month, and uh, it's a very nice tank. It's a crap all armor, but yeah, who needs armor? You've got a gun like this. So, we're going to have a bit more gameplay off, and then we're going to have a compilation, and there up C. All the kills that you could have seen. To a bit of music, and you can really dance and watch some kills. So, I hope you have enjoyed. Let me know down below what you think about Operation Summer, like I did say before. That's probably the third time now. And uh, yeah, please leave a comment, leave a like, and uh, feel free to subscribe for more. We are doing better on the channel, we're getting more subscribers now, and uh, yeah, things are looking up. So, thank you so much for watching, and uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next one.